This is Damo, and this is Go or Don't Go my mo with my movie review. Ugh. With my movie review of the Muppets. Um, the Muppets that I went to see it on opening day. I was really, really excited. Um, don't judge me. I'm 26, but I was really excited to see this movie because of the build up to it, and the you know the viral marketing, and the videos, and the trailers, and the parody trailers, and it was a good movie. I thoroughly enjoyed myself. Um, I don't really think I should go over the plot, but I'll give you a little bit. Basically, two characters played by Jason um, Siegel, Gary, and Walter, who plays Walter, uh, the Muppet, um, get these tickets to go to Los Angeles to go see the Muppet Studios, um, the old Muppet Studios, and get a tour of it with Amy Adams, who plays Mary. And they find it, you know, dilapidated and... Um, the studio is run down and then they find out that Oil Tycoon is trying to basically dem demolish it so he can use the area right under Kermit's office for oil. Um, I'm really not going to say much more about the plot and describe it in detail. All I will say is that it's very, very entertaining. I, I, I really enjoyed myself. This movie really made me smile. Um, the characters, a lot of people are complaining about the voices. And here's the funny thing to me. The voices do, it is noticeably noticeably different in the movie that they do sound different from um, when Jim and Frank were doing them way back when. But when you hear them in the interviews, they sound a lot closer. You know, when I see them on live TV, excuse me, when I see them on a lot of the interviews that they've done, Miss Piggy just did Chelsea lately, um, Kermit did Ellen, and when I was watching those interviews, they kind of sound more like the um, more like the original um, people that did them when they're on TV live rather than the movie. But that's really not a big issue. But I did want to um, I didn't want to touch on that. Another thing is with this movie, the music. Oh my God, it's catchy. It's really good. Uh, the Life's a Happy Song is probably definitely the best one, and it actually. To me, ranks right up there with all the um, all the, Muppet, the classic Muppet songs. Another song that I liked in there was Me Party, partially because I love Miss Picky, and I love the fact that she sings a song, not really about her love for Kermit, but the fact that she's okay partying by herself. I, I don't, don't judge me, but that does something for me. Uh, with the movie, it's really good. There are a lot of celebrity cameos, a lot of celebrity cameos. Uh, some of them that are in the trailers aren't in the movie, so don't expect with all the trailers that you see to see everybody that you see in the trailers and the movie. A lot of scenes that are in the trailers that are not in the movie. Well, not a lot, but a few. Another thing, stay until the end credits of the last song, because if you want to know everything that happens in the movie, um, the the resolution to everything you have to watch the credits to get it and that's all i'm going to say about the plot without trying to give off any spoilers or anything other than that i would definitely go this weekend to see it um today is the 24th which is thanksgiving i saw it yesterday morning um i highly suggest that you go it's not just a kid's movie. Everybody will enjoy it, and it's a pretty good time. And there are a lot of laugh-out-loud moments that just keep coming and coming and coming and coming. A few jokes that fall flat, but the majority of them, you know, are good. So I give this a definite go. So go see The Muppets in theaters. I hope you enjoy it. And this has been Go or Don't Go with Damo. And this The Muppets, uh, Disney's The Muppets, is definitely a go. Have a great day.